Angeles there. We'll turn now to I-Team 8. The man accused of killing three people in a shooting in Lawrence on Friday. He had an arrest warrant when that shooting happened. Yeah, I-Team 8's Cody Fisher uh, did a deep dive into the criminal history of Malik Shaw. According to court documents, Shaw has multiple convictions, but he hasn't served serious jail time. In 2019, at the age of 19, Shaw pleaded guilty to misdemeanor auto theft in Sullivan County, and he was given time served. From there, he was given time served for stealing a cell phone from a YMCA in 2022. In 2023, he pleaded guilty and was given time served for stealing a gun from a gun store. That same year, he pleaded guilty to misdemeanor possession of marijuana and unlawfully carrying a handgun. In that case, he was the passenger in a car that got pulled over. The driver ran from police. During that stop, officers found just under one and a half ounces of marijuana and several guns on Shaw. He pleaded guilty to two misdemeanor charges and was given time served and put on probation. Last September, he violated that probation by not coming to several probation meetings, not submitting drug screenings, and testing positive for marijuana. The court revoked his probation and issued a warrant for his arrest. That warrant was still active when police say he shot three people in Lawrence on Friday night. I reached out to the Marion County Sheriff's Office for an interview to find out how they prioritize active warrants for arrests, but they did not get back to me. Right now, Shaw is in the Marion County Jail. His first court hearing for the murder charges will be Thursday morning. Reporting in Indianapolis, Cody Fisher, Wish TV, ITMA.